This is the story of a man's ultimate kindness, a man who seized an opportunity of his life to make a difference. Dave Walters, a generous man with a heart to help others. The infusion center at Wilcox Hospital was completed within a month of my chat with Dave. And sadly, he ended his battle with cancer just weeks before the dedication and grand opening. Yet his presence was felt in the warmth and comfort of the healing environment he created. Uh, approximately 12 years ago, I was diagnosed with uh, prostate cancer, uh, PSA of over 700 tumors throughout the body, and told uh, to get my affairs in order. Um, which was probably a good wake-up call for me because I was just working all the time and uh, and not really concerned about those, those issues of um, if something did happen to me. So I've um, uh, been being treated for the last 12 years. I last obviously outlasted the six months I was told I was going to have, and I've had a great life here in Kauai. We've got a really amazing team. We call them the Chemo Queens. Mickey and, and Darcy and Sue and the, the whole group. Uh, it's just been wonderful. Uh, what I am doing right now is I'm having a new chemo infusion room built here. It's costing uh, it'll be close to a million dollars. We're done. I'm donating that because I want a place for them to come instead of it being a windowless environment. There's lots of light, uh, very much like you walking into a Four Seasons with inlaid wood floors, great original artwork, sculptures, paintings, like with George Sumner, and Ma, uh, Bud Bottoms, these people have, have donated to us those pieces. The Everything is completely custom made from the chairs we're doing. Uh, we had them made so that you can lay out flat 180 degrees. When they come up, they help you set up if you're not able to get up. They have massage units built in them because when you lay there that long, it, it does start to affect you. They have uh, heat units built in them because quite often you're getting infused with a cold drug. Um, there's individual panels between each of the chairs, but yet they're opaque and done with natural bamboo so you can see through a little bit, but not really. And, and everyone has their own private TV that plugs in and every, the wireless uh, internet so that you have a great experience because I think that really helps our chemo queens more than anything because they're, they're giving you the enthusiasm. Now here's a help for them. And of all those places I've been, whether it's Cedars or Mayo or you name it, I've never met a more professional or a more caring group than the chemo queens are here. They're just phenomenal. Dave Walters was a cattle baron sponsor for the Hoedown for Hope and a cowboy at heart. Oh, Dave Walters, everybody! Whoa! A brave cowboy who wrestled and fought off cancer with remarkable courage. I think I can speak for most of the cancer community here in Kauai when I say thank you to Dave. Thank you for opening your heart and sharing your love and friendship with us um, because you are making a true difference, not only in our lives, but in lives of generations to come. So thank you, Dave.